this book talk is a twofer. Um, it is um, two books and you could read either one of them independently, but they're also connected. So first I'm going to start with this. And th these are not brand new books, but they're relatively new. Um, some of these you might recognize. So this is Fangirl. Okay. So if you are interested at all in fanfic, whether you write it or you read it, or you just think it's kind of a cool idea, um, this is a story, the main character um, really likes to write fanfic and that's like her thing. She writes fanfic, really good fanfic. Her name's Kath um, and she is um, a twin and you know they were both very very into this series it's called the simon snow series simon snow um an analog for that in real life would be the harry potter series so imagine that kath and her twin are obsessed with harry potter wow. um and they write a whole bunch of stories about that fandom and um you know if you know a lot about fanfic you know about shipping well in um kath's um, fanfic that she writes, she ships two characters, Simon Snow, who's kind of the Harry Potter figure, and um, um, Baz, who is essentially kind of the Draco Malfoy figure. Um, sh and I don't know if you can kind of see, I don't know if I can get this to focus on it, but there's, you know, the, the she's thinking about them being in love um, and as she's writing her fanfic. And so this is a story about, you know, going to college, about growing apart from your twin, um, um, about trying to find your place as an adult once high school is over, um, and about the love of, you know, a fandom, a fanfic and everything else like that. Okay. So this is what, and like purple, realistic fiction, right? This is a realistic seeming story. It's just that the main character is kind of obsessed with this fantasy world, right? Okay. Now, before I show you this next book, I want to tell you I am buying a new copy of this book because I hate the cover art on this one and they came out with better cover art. So don't judge a book by its cover. This book is Carry On. Okay. Carry On is Kath's fanfic. Um, it is the story of Simon Snow um, and his basically his last year at this magical school and he's like the chosen one who's supposed to save the world and he's supposed to be so magical and so powerful um, but there's um, and, and then this character Baz who's supposed to be kind of a bad guy and of course then it turns into a romance um, because that ship that happens in fangirl is what happens in the story it's not written like you're not going to see calf in this book at all this is just a straight up fantasy this is the story um and so if you loved harry potter but maybe you've grown up a little past harry potter and maybe you have felt like oh you know some of the stuff around it was a little cheesy and oh maybe you know the author of harry potter i don't really like her political views right now as they happen to deal with um trans people and and things like that um, I cannot recommend this book enough. I am such a fangirl of this book. It's actually a trilogy and I'm reading book three and I'm just ridiculously in love with this story. Um, it's kind of like, hang on. It's like in Harry Potter, if you imagine that Harry and Draco Malfoy were roommates and they fell in love. And if you imagine that Hermione came from like a Weasley sort of a family, like a really big family um, with not like a lot of, like they're not a very posh family, not a really rich family. My son wants some orange juice, um, but very powerful and very smart. And, and like the person in charge of the school, everyone thinks he's like Dumbledore and they love him, but really it's Snape. And, I don't know. Like it just, it plays with all of that so much. Um, and then it turns it upside down. Like it just messes with all of those tropes um, that are so familiar to us in the Harry Potter generation. And it is a fantastic love story. Oh, and basically everybody's gay um, in one way or the other. It is just a fantastically fun <laughs> fantasy story. Um, my son now wants markers. He wants markers and orange juice. I'm in the middle of my video. But if you are looking for something that's kind of like a grown-up Harry Potter that's going to make you laugh and you're going to have so much fun, I totally recommend Carry On and the rest of this trilogy. And if you are more on the realistic fiction side of things, you know, a fan of fanfic, you might also like to read Fangirl. Did you get this color, Mama? 
What color is it, Daniel? Pink. 